Oh shit, motherfuckers, we're back. It's week two. It's the Quahog Clams versus the Alkaline Energizers. All right, this is something I can actually fucking work with. I'm assuming Quahog is a Family Guy team against batteries or whatever the fuck it is. Maybe it'll be a bunch of dodos on this team. Who knows? We got Stewie Griffin kicking it off. Jesus fucking Christ, a team with players I actually understand. This is, this is great. Whoever made these teams, you know, God bless you. It's not a bunch of fucking dog shit that I had to call last week. Good lord. This is JB, current champ of the regular TFO. And I'm here to bring you some fucking heel heat. And, uh, some, some terrible fucking commentating. Cause it's just me. I don't have my commentary guy FK with me, so... Who knows? What I will say is I can appreciate the energi the Alkaline Energizers fucking uniforms. Pink and pink, I love it. Gotta give it to you. First down, they look like a, a decently competent team. They had a, a running back who's a little quick, looked like their quarterback was quick. Quarterback's definitely quick. And the Quahog Clams here got a decent defense too. They got a couple guys that are quick off the blocks. I think this might actually be a decent game. Who knows? If you guys paid attention to last week and judging by the views you didn't, you're gonna know that I don't give a fuck when I commentate, and I'm gonna bring a bunch of bullshit and make you guys real fucking mad. At least that's what I hope to do, but you know, who knows? Some of you might actually be cool people and be able to, to stomach some of this shit, but most of the guys in TFO can't because they're a bunch of little bitches. But uh, I don't know who any of these guys are on the, on the Alkaline Energizers. I just know that they're all pretty quick, and he's definitely gonna be suffering somewhere. But Khalil Mack's gonna throw it to Pondison? I'll get to see who this is in a second, because that's gonna be seven points, or at least six, whatever. Chester Pondison. All right, yeah, I don't know, and, and Buster Mack. Who the fuck are these people? I was expecting, like, double-A to pass to triple-A, maybe, like, C battery passing to 2022 watch battery, but no, we got a bunch of people. I don't fucking know who they are. However, Family Guy's up now, and I might actually know a few of these guys. I haven't watched Family Guy in quite a long time because I gave up cable like 10 years ago, but uh, you know, who knows? I don't know who Swanson is. Hmm, I'm assuming Peter Griffin's the quarterback. He's gonna go to Deaf Guy? Greased Deaf Guy. Oh, I remember Greased Deaf Guy. Alright, I like this. I like this a lot. And Greased Deaf Guy actually has some wheels on him. Five missed tackles where he finally gets brought down. Big yikes. First and eight here. It's Peter Griffin's gonna hand off to... Oh, I'm sorry, it's a Flea Flicker. Is he going to Stewie? No, not Stewie. Probably Chris? Chris Griffin? Brian Griffin. Fucking dog? Why is the dog not faster than that? Oh, well, fuck it. I don't know what to do with you damn rookies. Stewie's gonna kick this one off, or, uh, kick this one for the extra point. It's good, at least they actually paid Stewie something. I hope they're using a bunch of these, these gadgets that Stewie, Stewie makes to make their team excel. Looks like they only paid three guys on their defense, so that's probably gonna come back to hurt them. Here goes Carmen San Diego, and she is fast as shit. Brings it out to the 19. Let's see what the Energizer Bunny's gonna do. Why don't you guys have the fucking Energizer Bunny? We need him. He, that motherfucker never gets hurt. He just keeps going and going and going. I got two cats with me here. I'm kind of upset. Not the one that shows cocaine up his ass, but that was a hell of a juke by Bobby McBride. I don't know what the fuck his first name is. I'm just gonna call him Bobby McBride. Finally gets taken down, like a fucking 70 yard run. The Energizer Bunny would have would have made that into six though, but you know. <laughs> Whatever. Here goes Khalil Mack. Gets stuffed on the... What the fuck is it? Like a rollout L or QB bootleg? I don't fucking remember what these stupid plays are called. I just know which ones are good and which ones suck. He's got some room. Defense in there quick, though. Maybe he actually paid the, the D-line? I don't know. It's not really important. They're gonna hand it off to Bobby McBride, though. Can't quite get it. Gets the first down, though, so they're gonna get a couple more shots at this. See what the clams can do. My, my question to the clams is why the fuck aren't you guys fucking white with green pants? That would have been perfect. But, you know, hey. Not everyone can have cool uh, fucking uniforms like Khalil Mack here and Bobby McBride. Once again, Twerks McBride. And it might as well be fucking Twinks McBride with this these uniforms. Buster Mack, whoever. Uh, he's fucking Triple A. I'm just calling him Triple A. It's about what this league is, the fucking AAA league. 
Successful try though, 7 to 14, big scoring fourth quarter here as Bayonetta kicks it off to Ron Swanson from Parks and Recreation. Ron Swanson's just angry at everything. Parks and Rec isn't a show I'm really familiar with or a fan of, but Ron Swanson is actually pretty funny. Peter Griffin, pretty quick for being a fat guy. Nice QB scramble for seven, not too shabby. I'm gonna run the rollout R here. Uh, no, I'm sorry, roll out L. This is now a band play <laughs> in our league, so I'm not used to seeing that. Oh, I did run it last year. Excellent play. We're gonna run the slot off tackle to, uh, fucking Brian, maybe? We do have another dog in our league. Quarterback of the DC Universe, Super Dog Crypto. Well, he's much better than Brian. Gonna run the flea flicker. It's Quagmire, wide open. Now, Quagmire, that, that's a guy I can get behind. Hey, Meg, how old are you? 16, 18, all right. Gotta love Quagmire. They need to make a whole fucking show about Quagmire. S stick that bitch on Adult Swim, make it fucking TVMA, unrated at 2 in the morning, just be fucking titties, and and fucking Gwen just fucking everybody. It'd be hilarious. Actually, that, that's called hentai, but, <laughs> you know, whatever. It'll be on the internet somewhere, it's fine. Carmen San Diego throws on her red dress and her red hat, and she's gonna take this one out. Just decides to run straight into people, which, coming from a whore like that, I'm not really surprised. Energizer's ready to go. 4.15 left in the half. Let's see if Khalil Mack can make something happen. I'm, I'm sorry, Triple A. They run the Blitz Beater. They get uh, two off it. Not bad. Not bad. Triple A back to pass. Got some options. And the Aqua Rab? Is that some sort of like weird Arab dude, Aqua Rab? I don't know. Maybe that's single A battery, C battery. Maybe it's car battery. Car batteries are black, right? Does that make sense? Triple A car battery. Good touchdown. Is that like the Dura Last Gold? Wow, that was quick. 14 to 21. High scoring game here with some actually halfway decent offenses. Some of you guys got some help from other TFO vets, ain't no fucking doubt about it. You know rookies can't make fucking offenses this competent. Quahog clams here. 3.30, they're gonna hand it off to Ron Swanson, who almost had a bump, could have made that big, but their fucking wide receiver has no strength, so, you know, get fucked. That's what happens. Shotgun formation. Or, I'm sorry, the bow and arrow, as I call it. Here's Ron Swanson. Finds some holes and makes it happen. Gonna, gonna fucking juke Mary Slanders for the first down. I'm not sure if, if the offenses are good or the defenses are just dog shit. It could be a combination of both. I mean, I'm fine with it. I like games that are actually halfway exciting to call. They're gonna keep running the shitty play. It finally gets dropped. They're gonna need a nice a nice pickup here if, if they hope to con oh nope never mind get fucked Ron Swanson can't quite bureaucrat his way out of that one. They're gonna go with the field goal 50 yarder, pretty good size. That's gonna be a horrible brick if it doesn't get blocked. Wide left, eat shit. The Energizer Bunny and Triple A here. Let's see if Triple A and Car Battery can hook back up. Nope, they're going to Bobby McBride. Within two minutes now, they're going to call timeout. Not sure why, but hey, coaching in Tecmo isn't exactly the greatest. Going back to Bobby McBride when they should be throwing. Although he does get the first down, so maybe they're trying to, to get the clock as low as possible and then score on the clams. Who knows? Their fucking uniforms are pink. Dude, anything could happen. Here's the blitz beater to Bobby McBride. Can't quite get around the linebacker, but gets a lucky bump. And they're gonna call timeout. Minute 20 left on the clock. First and 10, 45 yards to go, running the QB naked bootleg. Had all the room in the world and instead decides to go up and get shit on. Second and 10, blitz beater again. Safety's down there to cover that shit up. Third and eight, running the bow and arrow. Blitz coming, gets fucked by Mort Goldman. I don't know who that is. I don't know these these fucking Family Guy sub characters. And that's fine, I guess. I can't really know everybody. At least you guys had 
common courtesy to make a fucking team that makes sense. Well, let's see if Raw and Swanson can make something happen. They're gonna run the slot off tackle here. Giving it to Brian Griffin, the pup. Drunk as shit. Can't do anything. He fumbles. Who's got it? It's Daft Quincy. I, I don't know who that is, but he's not quite gonna make it. That's gonna end the half. Lucky, lucky time to fumble for Kohar. It's halftime here. It's 14 to 20. We got some sluts. We got some more sluts. We're gonna get panties. Hell yeah, panties. There we go. And uh, a winky slut. Good job, slut. Oh no, I'm sorry. That's the kissy slut. My bad. Bayonetta here is gonna kick it off to Ron Swanson. Let's see if Ron Swanson can do something decent. Mm, doesn't look like it. Fumbles again, and it goes out of bounds. Damn, the Energizer Bunnies cannot catch a break on these fumbles here. Well, there's a blitz. Ron Swanson's gonna get tackled quickly. A loss of seven, Jesus Christ, get fucked. What a throw, that's actually a backwards lateral and should have been a fumble, but you know, whatever, technically doesn't make sense. Running the rollout L, they got wide receiver two wide open, it's greased up Def Guy with a horrible throw from Peter, eat shit. That should have been a fucking touchdown all day, pay your goddamn quarterbacks, guys. And Carmen San Diego putting that red hat on again, she's got someone coming quick. Puts the juke on, game is slowing down horribly, <laughs> it's tackled after like a 15 yard return. Khalil Mack here, also known as Triple A, is gonna run the bootleg. Nope, not quite. Runs out of juice. Gotta get them double A's, man. Look at the old Game Boy, original Game Boy. Four double A batteries. That fucker lasted forever. Here's the pick to pitch to Bobby McBride. Safety's covering it. And Bobby McBride goes down. Get fucked. Twinks McBride, also known as Robert McBride. Who they bring? Oh, Carmen San Diego's coming in. All right. Let's go, Carmen. Here it is. Hands off to that fucking red-hatted slut. Let's see her get injured, too. I heard she likes it rough. Probably won't go down this game. She's gonna wait till after the game. Another pitch to Carmen San Diego. This is a heavy rush team. Look what the fuck's going on. There's probably 17 heavy rush teams in this fucking league. Here comes the naked bootleg to Triple A. Triple A can't quite do anything. The clams need a stop here. It's a big play for them. Can they get the blitz? They got the blitz! Carmen goes down, loss of five. Energizer Bunny's out of field goal range, gonna have to kick it away. Reggie Miller's gonna boot this one. Looks like it's gonna be just a little far. Yep, four yards too far. Not bad though. The clams will take it at the 20. Just give it to fucking Ron Swanson. Here he goes. Oh no, it's Peter Griffin on the rollout L. Going to Brian. Pick up a seven. <laughs> Sorry, I do a terrible Peter Griffin impression. Ooh, missed by the right end. I don't know who that was. Why? No, tight end maybe? I, don't know, I can't I can fucking forget what that play is. Well, it's coming by the bunnies. That's going to bring up fourth and eight. Quahog Clam's going to have to punt this away. Which is unfortunate, because the Bunnies are a much better team. Here we go, Carmen San Diego, backup running back, gonna take this one. Can she put the Jets on? A lot of room. Nope, does nothing. Gets swallowed up by... Very slow to start defense, but must have a lot of excel, because they, they get quickly up to speed. Here goes Triple A. Triple A makes a miss. Not bad, run of 25? My eyes serve me crazy, they probably don't. First and ten here, triple A. Not a lot of options. Wide receiver two? Nope, gonna take the sack. Fuck it. Crazy Opie. No idea who that is. Loss of ten though, that's gonna hurt. They're gonna let triple A run the bootleg again. Nothing. Third and seventeen. Clams need a stop here to force a huge field goal. They're gonna let triple A run it again. And he fumbles out of bounds, though. Pickup of 11. They're going to kick the manageable field goal, but let's see if they actually paid their kicker. Who is their kicker? Oh, it's Bayonetta. Nope, it gets stuffed. It would have been a good kick. That's huge for the clams. 
can they actually do anything with it? Nope, Ron Swanson gets eaten up. Too much bureaucratic red tape. They're gonna try the, the rollout L. Yes, they are. They got someone wide open. It's wide receiver one. Who is it? It's Quagmire. He has a touchdown earlier today. Jump catch. Is he fast enough to make? Oh my god, their defense is slow. Yes, he's fast enough. Glenn Quagmire on the broken coverage. I think he's already fucking a 16-year-old in the stands. Good job, Glenn. Totally illegal, but good job. Bernie Slander's gonna try and block this one. He gets it. They're gonna have to onside kick this one. But they're kicking it away! They're gonna trust the defense to not fuck up here. And to be fair, the Energizer Bunnies haven't done much in the last... Actually, at all. I think they had 21 going into the half. Triple A's gonna hand it off to Carmen San Diego. Defense is coming. She gets around it with a huge gain. Oh, this is terrible. Ricky Williams somehow gets back there to the right end all the way from the other side of the field to make the tackle. First and ten, they're gonna let Triple A run the bootleg. Oh, we get stuffed. Eat shit. Only a pickup with two. Looks like they're gonna try it again. Defense is up there. Plenty of people. Picks up four? Yeah, four. The clams call timeout. They need a stop here. Looking for that almighty blitz. They're gonna run the bootleg again. Gets the first, not much more, but still got it. That's what's important, that clock. Tick, 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 tick. 2.43 left in the half. A touchdown damn near seals the game at this point. Running the bootleg again. They're just going to triple A, but he can't do much with it. I don't know why they're putting their quarterback at risk like that. They're going to try to throw. Triple A to Turkman. Lucky it didn't get picked off. Brings up a third and nine. Now they're gonna try the bootleg again. Nope. Pitch to car in San Diego. Not fast enough to get around the blitz. Field goal doesn't really do that much for him. It might brick though. They the clams might get lucky. Nope, it's good. They need a touchdown now. It's Bayonetta from that's from Bayonetta 2, actually. Comes out on Wii U. What a shitty fucking console that was. Here comes Ron Swanson. He's going to need a big return here, and he's slow as dog shit. Gets tackled immediately. If I were them, I would go to Glenn Quagmire on this one. Well, that ain't going to help. Rat Bernie Slanders. President presidential candidate going to try and take out Trump this year. Ain't going to happen. Here's Griffin. Deontay Samuels. Who the fuck are... What, what do these people have to do with batteries? Are they, like, employees at a fucking battery company? Like, oh boy. That is bad. Fucking Energizer Bunnies got the clams on their heels. Fourth and 26. Gonna need Quagmire big time. Defense coming. Fumble in the end zone. Touchdown by whoever the fuck that was. Bernie Slanders. Jim Harville. I guarantee you no one has heard of any of these fucking people. I'm... Immediately uninterested in the alkaline batteries. That's gonna be good. 11 point game. Bayonetta kicks it off to Ron Swanson. Swanson's gonna need a huge return and a very, very quick score. But you can probably seal this one up as their, their offense has become pretty inept as of late. Let's see what the clams do. They're gonna run a, some sort of fucking weirdo pass. No back X deep. Gets stuffed immediately by Samuel Adams. Try the rollout L here. Nope, just hands it off to Swanson. Who makes some people miss. Is gonna get a big chunky yardage. Hopefully get some dive misses. Nope. 48 seconds on the clock. They're gonna need a huge pass here. What are they going to go with? A sack. Samuel Adams in there again. Second and 18. I think the clock is insurmountable at this point. Running the rollout L. Going to go to the ground from Bernie Slanders. Third and 28. This game is over. I should just fucking stop talking right now. Clams going to run some weirdo play. And they've got a greased up deaf guy with a nice throw. Too bad it's too little too late. Oh, he scored, damn it. Now I have to watch this fucking animation. 
Greased up deaf guy. Him and Quagmire are the only people who score anything. Which is kind of sad, actually, but hey, whatever. That one's going to be good. 27-31 is going to be your final. The Energizer Bunny is taking this one. Let's look at the stats. Eh, pretty even. Passing team against the running team. I don't understand the Energizers, their team, or who the fuck is on it, but hey, whatever. I'll unfortunately see you guys next week.